26-year-old virgin who has never had a girl interested in me. I'm thinking of paying a hooker. Because I think him an interesting guy who is kind and respectful. I put in effort into my Tinder bio but I never got a single match on the three years that I was on there. I'm tall. Athletic and I try to be attractive but even at bars I never get girls approach me or even look at me. I have tried approaching women but no luck. I'm also a virgin so I'm looking for some sexual experience although I think some men like me who ain't that attractive are just better off paying for it. Ask on the dating app subreddits for a profile review. There's a big chance that you could improve. You can also send me your profile if you want. Ask for an actual bio review by other women. Also, focus on yourself and your hobbies. Without realizing it you might end up finding someone who matches with you just through your hobbies. Last note. 26 is still pretty young. So I would not even worry about this whole dumb pressure of losing your virginity. I'm 28 same thing as you I just don't give a f skull I'm chillin. Nobody can stop you but I wanna read your bio. Get an escort instead of street walker. You can learn some tips and tricks in how to engage with a woman socially and physically. You may gain confidence from this which will make it easier for you to approach women and be more confident for dating. I would try your luck with more women first. Sex is cool but get to know a person and form a connection with them. Some women are deep into virgins. Lol I'm a 24-year-old woman who is basically in the same situation. Honestly it's not really a big deal lol. I lost my virginity at 28. And I gave it up to a complete stranger because of the world's pressure of me being a loser. Don't let this be you. Don't do it I've read so many stories on Reddit alone. About virgins sleeping with hookers and they all turned up disappointed and upset for doing it. I am a girl about your age. I'd be happy to look over your dating profile. I love to give feedback on those. I'm not offering an opinion on whether you should hire a working girl. But if you do, in the US you can go to a licensed Nevada cat house where the ladies are tested and there is a better chance that you won't be aiding organized crime that abuses women. Keep in mind that that some diseases are spread by skin to skin contact. There are the street walkers from pre-internet. Anyways. Yeah go for it. Might as well get it out of the way. Get that awkwardness out of the way kinda thing. Me thinks you need to re-evaluate your game as to why you've been unsuccessful. Just by referring to them as hookers tells me a lot of what you're about. P.S. Call an agency and not an independent escort. Pay the hooker get the virginity thing off your mind and move on without feeling weighed down by that label. Just do it. Fuck a prostitute. Who cares? She needs the money. You need the sex. Do it. Gets that monkey off your back. It won't be particularly enjoyable. But it ticks that psychological box. You'd be surprised being humble and honest about your situation. While maintaining respect and being a decent guy could work. It's not the end of the world. If you made a joke about yourself and your mild desperation to the right person. That could be enough. If you haven't had sex. It's everything. If you have. It's generally not a huge deal. Don't hide it. Don't overthink it. It's a numbers game. Be respectful first. But have some fun. And if this really is about sex and not specifically sex with a bang and hot dime piece. Lower your standards. It's fun. Oh. Sweetie. It's more than that. Maybe your energy is emitting a hands-off approach due to deeply rooted personal past hurts. 
resulting in a distorted outlook of self. Your projection to the world possibly doesn't match your 3D approach. I see it a lot. Know your worth BC I'm sure somebody does. You just need to look past your own instilled expectations and take a chance on something different. At times, what is yours will always just have to be receptive to it. Yes. Go ahead and do it. Take the opportunity to gain a better understanding of what you might be missing. Don't feel discouraged. As everyone develops at their own pace. In just one year, you can accumulate a lifetime's worth of experiences. Perhaps consider engaging with women who are at a lower stage in life. Less attractive. Allowing you to learn and grow. Remember, the most important aspect is to approach these interactions with kindness, respect, and an openness to broaden your perspective. Ask the escort for pointers while you're at it. Go for it she'll happily diversionize you and put effort into it. You might even get a bonus. Bro even ugly dudes can pull its honestly personality something about you makes women avoid you. Probably got a look in ward my guy. Maybe you're not as good looking as you think you are lol. Or maybe you are and your personality sucks. Go go karting bro you'll find pleasure through the correct way not through lust and flesh. Do it. We need pics so we can see what we can work with. We're here to help a man. I mean, if I were you I wouldn't do it. With everything I know about prostitution, you'd most likely be raping a poor, drugged, from another country woman in exchange of money she would only get a part of. So, relationships are hard to develop. It's hard to get out there. But it's not worth throwing moral sense out the window. It sounds like you want a girl for sex rather than for a relationship. It also sounds like you're a little arrogant and at a guess your bio is probably about what you want rather than who you are. Remove any photos of fish, boyish hobbies or anything sexual no topless etc. When chatting do not bring up sex at all women want to be treated as humans. I'm married to a man I met online we have three kids. Didn't speak much before meeting. This comes across as a bizarre prelude to a piece of adult erotica. 38 year old virgin. I'm not paying for sex. I'm ready to die a virgin. At least, I will die with dignity. No shame. Enjoy. Don't. Not one match. Or the chatting never leads to anything. I think you need help with this profile. If you go the pay route. Maybe ask for a toned down experience so you don't set up some unrealistic precedent. No shame in being a 26 year old the second part that gets me lol. Ask on our roast me. Not that I've used them but spend enough time on Reddit. Having talked to three sex workers myself. I got to be honest. In the end it all doesn't seem worth it paying for some strange. Especially if it's your first. But you make your own mind. It likely won't be as good as it could be without a connection. As a woman I never once approached a guy in a bar but also if a guy was blatantly hitting on me or seemingly just wanted a hookup. No thanks. As others have said, have your profile reviewed. While sex work is legit it's also a good way to get an STI. If you decide to do that please be careful.